Good morning, this is the National Weather Service in Pleasant Hill with a daily weather briefing for Thursday, June 27, 2013. The main story for today will be severe weather chances across the region as a mid-level disturbance overrides an unstable air mass stretching over the central plains. Storms are expected to continue to develop over eastern Nebraska this morning and will begin trekking southeast into our area as early as noon today. If storms become widespread over southeast Nebraska this morning, the cloud cover associated with them could blow off to the southeast and decrease in stability over northern Missouri today, which would also decrease the severe weather potential in cloudy areas. While strong to severe storms are possible throughout the region today, severe weather is most likely in areas that can see a bit more sunshine, which would be much of eastern Kansas and possibly into western Missouri. The Storm Prediction Center has highlighted this area with a higher probability of large hail, damaging winds, and possibly a tornado, highlighted here in red. The window of time when strong to severe storms are most likely in our area will be early afternoon through the evening. Then storms should start to congeal and move south out of the forecast area late this evening. The other story for today will be hot temperatures this afternoon, especially in areas that see a good amount of sunshine. Highs today are expected to reach the mid to upper 90s over much of eastern Kansas and west central and southern Missouri, and will decrease as you move further to the north and east. These temperatures will combine with moderately high humidity this afternoon to make temperatures feel like the upper 90s to lower 100s during the afternoon hours. A heat advisory remains in effect for much of the area today, and lots of shade, rest, and hydration will be necessary for anyone spending time outdoors. The pattern will start to change pretty dramatically as broad upper-level low pressure deepens and spreads southwest this weekend into early next week. This will result in falling temperatures and highs in the 70s to lower 80s by the end of the weekend and into early next week. Widely scattered showers and storms are possible Saturday and Sunday, but the overall probability of seeing rain is pretty low for the end of the week into the beginning of next week. Thank you for viewing this multimedia weather briefing. For the latest information and forecasts specific to your area, please visit our website at weather.gov kc. You can also find us on social media following the links on this slide.